Hey guys, tonight we are in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, but we're not staying here for long. We're driving down the road to Gatlinburg, Tennessee, right on the parkway, almost dead center, to Guy Fietti's new Chicken Guy restaurant. We were hoping to go there last time we were here, but it wasn't open yet, but it's open now. So we're taking off, and you guys are coming with us. Are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Here's the whole inside of Chicken Guy. Welcome to Flavor Town. Here it is. Whole place. It's not real big. Got an arcade right next to it. What do you think of this man right there? This new restaurant here in Gatlinburg. Pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, I kind of like it. Modern, like you said. It's bright. Here are all the signature sauces. I was going to show you. This is up front by the register. We'll go over them again right back at the table. Here's what Guy's telling you about this chicken. He says it's hand-pounded, all-natural, antibiotic-free, never frozen, Bread it fresh every day. So when you come in, you order, and then they give you the buzzer. Once it goes off, you go up and get your food. 23, let me ask you a question. Do you know what famous basketball player was number 23? Yes, I do. I watched him for a long time when I was growing up. Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Jordan. <laughs> There's probably somebody out there that doesn't Jordan. know that. So let's go over the menu with their signature sandwiches. They come with two crispy fried chicken tenders. You got the Sauce Boss, the CG Classic, the Bourbon Brown Sugar Barbecue, the Big Bite, B-L-A-T, and the South Western. And there's your combos. We got one of them, we got the three tender combo. There's your chicken tenders. Now their chicken tenders are never frozen. Three tenders, $5.99, five tenders, $7.99. Each sauce is an extra 50 cents. There's some salad bowls. There's your kids' menus. And there, let's go over your sides. There's your sides and shareable sides. And there's your Flavor Town shakes. We got the apple cinnamon cereal. Hand spun vanilla soft serve cinnamon toast crunch and apple jacks. That sounds different, doesn't it? And there are your regular beverages. And the sandwich that I got was the bourbon brown sugar barbecue, pepper jack, bourbon brown sugar, barbecue sauce, special sauce, slaw, pickles, and barbecue kettle chips. So we're waiting for the buzzer to go off, and they actually brought the food to you. We thought it would go off and we would go get it, but they brought it to us. So it really looks Let's take a look at it. Up. Man, look at that. Man, there's some slaw. Look at the fried pickles. Two chicken tenders. Fries. And man, look at that. Look at the shake. And there are our sauces. Let's just break this down. First thing we're gonna try is the Apple Jacks and Cinnamon Toast Crunch Milkshake. Let's just look at it. Look at that. Try that out. 
I am a fan of Apple Jack cereal. And I taste the cinnamon a lot. A little bit of the Apple Jack. Can you taste it's the cold. combo? Yeah, you can, after you, um, you know, drink it a little bit, you can taste it. Is it real thick? It's not real thick. Ah, that looks good. It's a good texture. It's cold. Great texture. Let me try. Let me try it over here, guys. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Got a little bit of cereal on that bite. That's pretty good. It's different. Now we got fries. So we got the buttermilk ranch with the fries. The chicken tenders come with two sauces. You can order more, 50 cents a piece. Bobby wanted the sweet and sour. We wanted to try the number one, the special sauce. We're Bobby, I tell you what, go ahead and try a chicken tender with the sweet and sour. Now those look, by looking at them, they look excellent. Yeah. Let's see how big green. they are. Decent size. size. Decent. Yeah. Let's dip it in there. Dip that. Get Let's get that it. Show everybody. Show it. Show it. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Got a good crunch. Let's see inside. Chicken is tender. Is it hot? It is hot. You see? Now the sauce that you're uh, trying is orange, pineapple, honey, and vinegar. So one more time. I taste the honey. Don't really taste a whole lot of the vinegar. I guess with all three of those together, combined very well. Look like you got a little bit of seasoning in that, on that uh, crust on there, in the batter. You can tell that it's fresh chicken. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Man, it's making me hungry just looking at it now. Come on, I'm gonna have to try a piece of that. I'm gonna do these pickles. Now this buttermilk ranch, I don't know why I said it, but I said it came with the fries. It came with these. Probably because we eat ranch we with our fries. We go. That's a deep fried pickles. Look pretty good. It's just we're supposed to break one. It comes apart. Ain't breaking it. It's just dipping. Here we go. There we go. Yeah. Show the pickles. There they are. I like pickles. I'm gonna try one. Right. Two, two things. Wow. Pickles good. I like it. It's got, you know what? Wow. It's got a little bit of spice to it. Little. There's some kicking. A little bit. Kick in that. There is. I'm gonna try without out any of the ranch, but I'm gonna try. Mm. I like the coating on that, but yeah, you're it's right. Spicy. It's a little spicy. So this ranch, which is excellent all by itself, but even with the fries, you can even with the fries. Yeah. It cools it down. Yeah, and they're nice and hot. They are hot. I'm gonna tell you what, those have a good bit of kick in them. They're good. Fries. Fries. We'll try them without the ranch. Here we go. Try to see what's all on there. Mm. Wow. Definitely hot. Man, let's check those out, guys. Those are good. You know what? Kind of know one of the ingredients in there. And you can kind of taste it. It's can cinnamon. You, you can taste the cinnamon in that. Just a hint of it. Just a hint of it, yeah. But, uh, I'm sure it's got the little salt and pepper in there. You can kind of taste some salt. You can see, kind of see the pepper in there. That's what that looks like. That is some great seasoning. Okay, so we thought it was the Cody on these fried pickles. But the uh, gentleman that works here told us it's hot pickles. That's why it's so spicy. And they are spicy. They are. And he said, didn't he say also the same coating? Let me see that pickle one more time. The same coating, there we go, yeah. is the same, and you can see it. Yeah. It's the same as what's on the chicken. And it's excellent coating. Yeah. All right, I'm about ready to tear into this <laughs> burger. Try this. On my sandwich, I got so much going on. <laughs> I won't be able to tell what all it tastes like myself. Yeah, so. I'm just gonna go without, I'm going out. No dip. Yeah, try it no without dip. the dip. You definitely, Bobby's spot on. Definitely fresh. I mean, definitely. 
don't have any of that taste. Of it. Sometimes you get a chicken sandwich or a piece of get all that stuff in there, you don't even know what it is. It's kind of a grizzly. I don't know if you can't even describe it. It's nasty. It's just, that is so tender, isn't it? And the seasoning on it, knock it out of the ball. That might take me the rest of this vlog to break this sandwich down. You got some pepper jack cheese on there. Got the chicken tenders, of course. Got the special sauce, guys. That's what this is. We ordered an extra one. We have some barbecue sauce in there. Did you guys see that? Coleslaw. And right here, look. Barbecue kettle potato chips. Wow. So you'll have some crunch in that. And in here also is pickles. Pickles. So I'm gonna try to get it all in one bite. Yeah, that's Ooh. a pretty big sandwich. I better get it. I'm taking this napkin just mm -hmm. in case it doesn't fall all over my face. Here we go, guys. Wow. I mean, the combination of the slaw, the slaw by itself is excellent. The chicken, got a little bit of sauce, the pickles. There's a little spice there for someone. I guess that's coming from the pickle, maybe from the, the special sauce. We'll break down there in a little bit and tell you what's in the special sauce. But I mean, that is a good, and the barbecue chips. That is a great sandwich. Uh, one, you guys want one more? Okay, you want one more? I'm gonna go with this in, here we go. That is a meal by itself. <laughs> oh yeah, it looks I like, mean, we could probably have that. We can, I mean. But, well, I like, I like I mean, um, those are coleslaw. Big chicken tenders. It is. There's a lot of slaw, I like how there's sauce down here. Barbecue sauce up here, the mixture, and the one thing that's standing true right now is the bun's not falling apart. And normally, a sandwich like this, with slaw on it, it's all over the place. Yeah, so that's a sign of a good bun, isn't so, it? God, excellent job. Here are the signature sauces. I told you I was going to tell you what was in that special sauce that we got. It was mayo, ketchup, mustard, pickle juice chicken guy special spices and seasoning and there are all your different sauces you guys want to see what they are just pause the video I think there's 22 of them so it's 50 cents more to add on each one Asheville hot honey and their sauces are gluten-free except for three of them I want to say something Bobby's been sitting here going, whoo, wow. And I'm like, what's going on over there? Tell us about it, Bobby. Well, I have trouble eating hot stuff all the time, <laughs> but these are so good. I can't stop eating them, even though they're spicy. Because I dip them in there. But I don't care how spicy they are, I'm eating them. <laughs> yeah, because I told her, I said, what's wrong? I said, quit eating those things. She said, I can't. So, you might, you guys, what were those? $3.99. You might want to order an extra order of those. Once you get the ranch with it. Let's check out the receipt. Got the combo with the sweet and sour sauce and the special sauce and the fountain beverage with the fries. Apple cinnamon cereal milkshake, $4.99. There's that sandwich for $6.99 and the fried pickles for a grand total of $30.55. Well, we just left Chicken Guys here in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. You guys like the Ripley's Aquarium behind us. It's beautiful up here too. But let's talk about the food. What did you think about it, Bobby? I was very impressed with the food. I mean, the restaurant was very clean. When we first walked in there, everyone was very friendly. Um, our server came back and talked to us a few times. Even though you order up front, they bring your food to you. Uh, that chicken was excellent. It was moist. You could tell it was fresh. And also um, the pickles. I'm usually not somebody that likes hot stuff, but I couldn't stop eating those pickles in that ranch dressing. And what did you think about the milkshake? I like the milkshake because I like apple jacks. Cinnamon toast crunch I'm not real crazy about, but really those two blend together. Yeah, Excellent. it was. I would get it again. Yes, I would we too. normally get chocolate. If you guys follow us, you would get chocolate all the time, but I'm glad we got that. That sandwich, 
huge. We could have split that. We could have. That's almost too much for one person to eat. It had great flavors going on in there, and the atmosphere was good. So, guy knocked it out of the ballpark with this. So, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J, J and B have left the building.